Westline TV. Spice up your day. Hello, it is again the vibe show on your screen brought to you by Westline TV. I've told you if you have not pressed on that subscribe button, do so now so that anytime we post any video, you will be the first and get the chance to watch it. Today we have an interesting topic on board. My name is Bake, but before I introduce the topic and introduce the guests that I have in the studio, let's go quickly for a break whilst we watch the entertainment fan bit for today. Everything is set. Yeah, I'm the the of the year. of the year. Everything is set. And we are set to award brilliant talent for the year in review 2022 and we are here to say are you cool so we stand on behalf of everybody in the western region so this is the plaque and we are ready to award Artists of the year, twenty twenty three, Western Music Awards. So today on the Vibe Show, we have an interesting topic, just as I told you. I'm sure most of you, one way or the other, are living with people that maybe you're not supposed to be your friends be your family and probably are not comfortable there but you find yourself living with people yes we all need people to live on earth to be happy and all so one way or the other we find ourselves living with people but there is another situation when it comes to living with people that most of the time we call it there's a name that is given to it uh what friend is it is a cohabitation yes um, I don't know about it though. You know me, I talk for you. I talk for the people. Me, yeah, I I talk for you. So today, I want to understand that word, the term, situations where oh, I work at the cohabitation. And right here on the vibe show, as you know, we are going to let, we are going to have fun. And I have with me in the studio two beautiful women that I'll be having today's discussion and interaction with. But then. Let's have our health tip for the day. To the vibe show if you just join us we just started so don't be scared okay just stay tuned watch 
whilst we have this interesting topic for the day. Okay, so I have with me in the studio two beautiful ladies that I'll be talking with them when it comes to the topic for the day, which is cohabitation. And I have with me Miss Kitty Menu Hema. Actually, Hena, Menu Hena. Oh, okay, Menu Hena. Uh, Ms. Gipti Menu Hena, she is the CEO of Classmates Joint. Hello, Gipti. Hello, madam. The Classmates no Yavide? It's a pub. Oh, okay. I'm not going to be a school for one joint. What's your day? Oh, okay. So she has a pub that is called um, Classmates Joint. So that is Ms. Gipti Menu Hena. Ene. Yene no more trunk on one day. Also, I have with me Nanaya Edo. Somebody. <laughs> so I have with me Nanaya Edu, who is an entrepreneur. Maybe some of you know. Entrepreneur and a philanthropist. Hello, Nana. Hi, okay. How are you? I'm doing great yourself. I'm fine. In the minimum, I don't we produce all year. Walk off a couple of food tea that I bring in there. So they want they want to be put to know my true color. Don't worry. <laughs> anyway, you're all looking very beautiful Thank and wonderful you. today. You. Welcome on the vibe show. Thank you. I had it on your home open. I might be wrong, but Edward Jereba and Sister Gitti the Nigeria, man, she made a caravan. No, he ain't in a year. She had it. Eh, wah, ha. Iti, obi be fi be fi wudim, obi fi be fi Gitti ne dim, obi so be fi be fi man, she made And that is the purpose of the vibe show, basically to educate it ourselves. Okay, so today the topic on board is a cohabitation. I'm a matter of aware in Nepal, but I, w I wish that we get a clear, we get a clear um, understanding when it comes to it because we sure that most of us we don't really understand that. And mm -hmm. see, maybe we misquote it and we do otherwise or we practice otherwise. And mm -hmm. see, we have a cohabitation and kasana. Um, what are we talking about? Okay, so cohabitation is simply um, living with your partner. Okay. Um, a B menu or partner this year, and then let's say, okay, and it's also living with your male partner, and then um, having a sexual relationship once you are not married. That is simply cohabitation. Okay, so that's why I see yeah, if I have my partner that we are not married. Yes. That is my boyfriend yes. and I'm a fiancé mm -hmm. or on your fiancé level, like to the end of fiancé level. A, a relationship, a just sexual a, a relationship. Sexual relationship. Yes. Now you decide that you're better now. Yeah. It's we call it we determine that one as cohabitation. Yeah. Okay, I think it explains itself. Cohabitation. Mm -hmm. And you say you have a sexual relationship. Okay. So you have a sexual relationship there. Okay, so then we get it clearer now. If you are living with your partner that you have a sexual relationship with, you guys are cohabitating. Cohabitating, right? Yes, yes. Yeah. cohabitating. Okay. And see, um, let's talk about it. Because, I meaning then, the, it, it looks very common now. Very, very. Very, very. Very, very. Because the man is in there, I'm going to try to most of the time. And then, I'm going to be no be. What's it boom? Or two more boom? Be a five. I saw the final in pool, we decided they were going to work. And all. And, yeah, but in Africa culture, I think it's not something that is really allowed. But, she had to <laughs> nah, eh. Hey. Western world influence and all that on our culture and it is this time around we find ourselves mm -hmm. doing it. But before we start discussing this topic, let's go and see what people think when it comes to cohabitation. And so I know why it's a be seen able to act like the handle. Because the woman, where you are full, I know you are called a beauty. Why the way to why I was a tap? The big young boy, I know that. Well, that comedian is a cock a crab and it's a no lack of a busy For me, I would say that it is not advisable for a lady to do that because 
and marriage is a long term goal and for you to achieve that you have to go through processes and through the process you get to identify who you are playing with you can't just stand up and say that i'm getting married no they have you have process that we have to go through before you get married so for you to um get that for you to achieve that long-term goal as a marriage you have to go through that processes you can't just wake up stand up and say i'm going to marry and so it gives us the privilege to also know who you are going to be with as a partner so i won't advise any girl any lady to go and practice a cohabitation actually it isn't something that is being one the lady you the lady you lose respect you lose your respect because there are certain things a guy has to do for you so far as you are with a guy the person will think say he doesn't you know, the person will give he will give you the maximum respect that you need because already when he has already seen your nakedness and you mean nothing to him again so that is how so it's something that is not good it means a girl not marry still know it's his boyfriend and in that sense the girl will lose respect and because the guy who lives with him, so instead of him getting married to the girl, he feels that they are staying together, so that must not respect him. He is settling down with you, not be there. So any, like anything, it goes sometimes just to a time that they abuse the girls and stuff. Okay. Oh, wow, nice one. So people have different views. You just want it for yourself. Oh, okay. But as I told you, over the vice show, Hadeda, the Eba Bushnya, Hanei Nanti has Yankasa when it comes to cohabitation. And that's why I have with me in the studio, Miss Gitti and then Nanaya. And before you go, what is that? People are talking about it. It's, it's normal. On your sheet. Most of the time, to personally, I see there, Sebsebi Ubi no Bi, Wafanyi Sana. One worry in Kwebo, they automatically know what's in the nature. So let's talk about Nyoma, um, Oma, situations are about we find ourselves cohabiting with our, should I say our partners? Mm -hmm. Our partners. What do you think are things that really causes this thing? Mm -hmm. I think financial purposes. Okay. Insecurities. Um, no. That's okay, in the uh, financial reasons, like, you know, is it they or financial situations will be better? Another mm, sometimes, uh, if I heard you right, it's like what what leads to that? Yes, people right? cohabiting with yeah, their partners. Yeah, and because in some families, you know, people okay. are less privileged okay. and all that. So when they meet a guy who is a bit financially secured. Okay. And they fall in love with that person. They feel like being with that person instead of staying in their homes. You get it. Okay. And some parents too encourages that. Some parents will be like, oh, this guy, he has money. You get it. He can take care of the family. So why don't you go ahead and stay with him? Some parents are even influenced mm -hmm. to some of these acts. So. But, you know, is it, is it something bad? Is mm, it something that we should describe? Depending on the motive behind it. Okay. That makes it bad or good, depending on the motive behind it. Okay. You get it. And to answer, um, if we can probably describe it as bad and good, that means it's not something we can totally condemn. Unless mm -hmm. they be a ne negative side, you know, you're much higher. Um, but okay, so let's take a look at this. Okay. I am single. No, I'm in a relationship. Okay. And then I decide to go and live with my boyfriend in okay. the same house. It shouldn't be necessarily because I am in love with the guy. Okay. But like she said, um, it could be financially related, okay. insecurities, and then other points, if I should say. Okay. Um, cohabitation, mm -hmm. looking at we as Ghanaians, mm -hmm. let's consider religion yeah. first. Mm -hmm. If we take religion and then we, we realize that even with our Christian religion, we don't agree to cohabitation. Okay. We see it as a sin because in a way, not even in a way, it is termed as fornicating. Okay. 
So far, then you will go in and say, Yes, thank you. Mm -hmm. We we can't say there it's bad or it's good when it comes to religion. Muslims, I don't know how they see it. Traditionalists, I don't know how they see it. But people have their personal reasons. That makes them cohabitate. And to say today, it is wrong. Let's say my reason, sir. Um, personally, it I might be okay for you. Yes. To somebody, no. It was it, a perfect exactly. decision. And see, enter your business that today my ABCI. I want to go outside there yeah. talks about cohabitation. Mm -hmm. yeah. And say you'll be new reason that. And Kede, as I'm really, we are not there in it. But religiously, you know, we'll be able to cohabitation and communicate. And since I have a book of the thing, I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying, Oh, I want to Growing up, even our parents taught us to be yes. religious. Yes. In Sawa Mama na if they are into traditional religion and they taught you that cohabitation is good, then why not? Or your own religion until you would accept it. Okay. But if you are coming from a Christian home like I do, growing up, my parents taught me that cohabitation is um, what do you it's call it? Good. It's it's not good. It is fornicating because if I know. I'm from in Kocha Pudem in Kasha Mukawa. In a meet to market and do. What's the friend of you? Or tell me the fair cohabitated. I found a Bokomodo. Bokomodo? Yes. Okay. Like what? What about Tsunami? Okay. What about Tsunami? Okay. The friend of you is from Bokomodo. Hmm. In this set, when you know what you're going to do, no me catch Tsunami no bra. Ako. Yes. Ako. Ako. It is fornicated. Only me but that. Excuse my wife. Yeah. Only me is but my. Basically, I'm doing what my wife people do. Yeah. Why do it? We ask for them to just do the the yes, needful. Exactly. And then we are good to go. Okay, but Erica Sano, so you made mention that if I am a traditional um belief, um, I mean like yeah. and me cohabitat parents. But I don't think they yeah, traditional religion even support that because, because they I don't know much. Even about even that. um I think the norm is Besia Debet Naho, no abo waru. Why your mind they are saying what do I could be in if he even those times in power is one I do not know. Your parents are already informed exactly. that you will get there. Yeah. Uh -huh. So you know, I don't think there's any religion that supports it. Um, I don't well, know about the Muslim and other I religion, or, or I, Buddhism. But, and... Yeah, I can't tell for them. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. But then for what I know when it comes to our African which is Ghanaian tradition, it doesn't support it. Mm -hmm. and, it uh, but in the way but, it does. In the way it does? Which is the traditional belief? Or in uh, belief. this Christianity life? I don't think they in... support it, but they end up seeing people. It's situation. Yeah, doing it. It's, it's situation. there. Situation is there, but um, the way a man can sometimes you know, life itself eh, will make you do things that you wish not to do. Not to do. You get it. This, uh, you move you from your house to stay with a guy and all those kind of stuff, relationship stuff. My sister made mention of something that he, she wouldn't move to stay with the, her guy yeah. because of love. But if you don't love that person, how would you go to some extent for that person? No, but okay, so I'm not saying I wouldn't. What, what I said okay. is people don't stay with their guys or their partners because of love. Mm -hmm. It's not basic. See, even in marriage, People say, like what we've heard, um, my personal research, for instance, even shows that lately people are not in love, but they are married. Yeah. Yeah, yeah people are, marry for different yeah, reasons. Yes, different reasons. Most of them are not even in love. Exactly. But I think when you take, when you, when you like... The majority, most of them people are, are married. Are married. Some people are even married because of companionship. People want to, why would you be That is a benefit. Also, I will be... Get in marriage. You, see, you know? You are in marriage. Like, 
echo counseling sections now I know a lot of counselors, I, I speak to them. They will tell you that even with marriage in Nkono, it's not based on love. Marriage isn't built on love. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. in love, in it's just a percentage of it, in as much as the same with relationship. Because we move, we move from relationships to marriage. Mm -hmm. it's, you can be cohabitating, mm -hmm. but there's a reason. The love would might be there. Yeah. The love, the love might not. But there might be, there. be more reasons why you exactly. are. Exactly. And then they're not all financial security and yeah. finances. Yeah. And it's sure that being in the one who will be probably have a friend. I don't even see after some. Into a book check. I can say. Okay. Yeah, so financially, you know, so. securities, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Financially, you know, so you you don't have money to cater for yourself. If it will be a while, so be multiple to entertain the money is in a pool. Ionism. In see, say, more boy, or you dream of, think of that he's rich, mm -hmm. but he's responsible, mm -hmm. he works, then why not go to get another? They go to get another. Because your parents cannot fend for you. It looks like Miss Gifted had done But, but Matt, now, you can still be in your home, at the comfort of your home, and the guy can still sponsor you. There's more to it than that. I see. Okay. So, if you think you're living in the comfort of your home, mm -hmm. And then the guy is going to sponsor you. Mm. That is where the insecurity comes in because in your head, mm. if they feel there, secure your dream, mommy, cry, it be cry. Then we go to our mama, we are sending them home. But also far west end in the north pole. Why should you even have that thoughts for your guy? Oh, people in the have. First place. That is why we call it insecurity. That's what I'm, I'm telling. If you, if you have this perception, if you understand that men cannot stay with one woman, mm. eh? There is no way you have insecurities. Are you saying men cannot stay with one woman? Yes. Let's go that oh, way. Th let, let's not go that way. That's, that's a topic. Yes. That is a topic. You're saying men cannot stay it. with one yes. woman. Yes. Let's not go that way. As a lady, way. you should be mentally strong. Okay. When it comes to relationships. Okay. I've been, I've passed through so many broken hearts. Mm -hmm. And so I've gotten experience. You get it. And so if my next relationship entering, I don't think I would do the same mistakes I did you previously yes, yeah. exactly. to my current relationship yeah. you get it that's what i'm saying it's a you know relationship itself eh? it takes a, it's a school it if takes a matured a person See, every single day this thing called relationship every single day we learn, learn something, something here and yeah. it takes it takes a matured person to, to go into a relationship well, you get it and you cannot be in a relationship and today you a friend will call you that i saw your guy uh, here with a lady so you have to go and fight what if you go there and you, uh, I said it's been poured on you. Mm -hmm. Yes, maybe you are even a side chick. <laughs> and this relationship thing, eh, it's like a race. We are all racing again. Whoever wins, it's take the ring. If you don't win, the relationship is again, no, your race, no, yeah. I will go back to your topic when it comes to cohabiting. Situations where most of us go through, um, most of us have this perception when it comes to relationship day. Most of the time, I don't imagine the end to our thoughts in another. And I don't know. So, you guys give me some reasons, factors that make people end up cohabiting with their partners. Quite some of them, obviously, were financial issues. So, on, a, on an average, do you think that it is, sorry to say, the poor that mostly find themselves in cohabiting? No, no, no. no. Okay, so never. So, in touch with a general thing, it's yeah, both the rich, the See, poor. We are, we are living in a generation <coughs> eh, whereby we are revolving each and every second of the day. Okay. Things are changing. Erica Sasha said in your intro, this is Shia Tria. Yes, Shia, I'm rough for now. I'm a film. I'm a baby. People are comfortable now with cohabitating a lot. In fact, before I got here, I read an article online and then they are saying about 55.7% mm -hmm. of people living in the world right now okay. are comfortable with cohabitating. Yeah. One, because they think living with their partner is more, almost likely the same as being married. The only thing that differentiates between cohabitating and getting married is the ceremony and the wearing your the ring. ring. Or oh, the laws abiding yeah. the two. Exactly. Of you. Because a cohabitator, Sabi, 
And that's that's the dangerous part of it. Yes. But when you are married, in there is a bisia no pana beini with si siara, it japadini awa na womba dia. That is what the, the law says. That's that the disadvantage in cohabit. You understand. And marriage. Exactly. So looking at the difference right now, eh, like basically cohabitating is covered. And made it seem to be good. Yes, like yeah. marriage. Mm -hmm. It's people are comfortable. With. Looks so, like looks like we have a lot when it comes to poor habits. A lot is happening. And lots is happening. Yes. And we'll go for a quick break. And when we come back, we'll talk about the lots that is happening. Mm -hmm. This is the vibe show. My name is. Okay, so welcome back from the quick break that we went. If you just joined us, this is the vibe show. Don't worry, we are not ending now. We still have more to say. My name is Baki, and before you call break, let me hear about cohabitation situations. Are Oma, a adult wedding, or decided they will go towards now. Yes, yeah, share the positive side and the negative side, both on partners and even the society as well. So if you just joined us, trust me, you have more to learn. So don't go anywhere. This is the Vibe Show brought to you by Westline TV. Again, if you have not subscribed, if you have not subscribed, just do so now, okay? Hit on the subscribe button whilst the discussion goes on. Okay, into, before you call a break, now, nah, the cohabitation and the year recovery. I can say P. Maybe reasons why people cohabit with their partners. Now, I mean personally, I feel like in a way, I do the what say um what do you wanna say? Why you we are what you had this a mini broken heart. I might be scared to enter into another relationship. Uh-huh. Mm. It's no minus time. No. Me, me, a, a percentage or my level of the for relationship bureau might be less. If you are first, no, but this time I'll be much careful. Mm -hmm. The whole day may a bit um, relaxed with entering into relationship. But here is the case now the percentage keeps going high when it comes to people making the decision to cohabit with their partners. Yes. Okay, that means it's probably good for them. Oh, of course, Mr. okay. Religiously, it's not good. It doesn't support it. But if individually people are benefiting from it, okay, and they choose to do it, I don't see why, in a way, maybe the, the, the cultures or the religion should support it. What do you think about what I'm saying? Uh, I'm a mom say, personally, I don't support cohabitation. Give me your reasons why you don't support it. Okay. Why you feel it's bad that it, it probably has to be condemned in a way? You see, um, I always compare two things okay. when it comes to cohabitation. Mm -hmm. um, I compare, not actually two things, but then I compare marriage and then cohabitation okay. a lot. Okay. Because, um, like I said, my, the only difference between marriage and cohabitation is you not having a marriage certificate and then wearing the ring. But you know, marriage keeps some kind of sanity. Cohabitation, there's no sanity. Okay. Marriage locks you from cheating. Okay. Wait. Fifty dollar I am monkey some Okay. I am saying marriage locks you from cheating because a worry pay you are not expected. Mm. for we hear an hour It is not allowed. It is not allowed, but okay. still, yeah. Cohabitation, you are not locked to it. In to say, I'm a busy, I mean, my boyfriend, the tea. Not said, did they are more shy? Then I'm a fat quick nature. A charming and titles need you. I did charm in them one hour and a little chip. Production manager, you did have him. Now, I will be, you know, you are trying to stop me from doing it. I can easily tell you that my buddy. 
Yeah, what shows really? we are married? Mm -hmm. I can do whatever I want, even though we are living together. Okay. But I'm not putting me here. We're being in. We're being not coming. We're not good at me. We're not married yet. But when I'm married, me you see, with respect today, I don't want to lose my marriage. Mm -hmm. With the thoughts that I don't want to lose my marriage, and then I would, in a way of respecting my husband, he shouldn't even see or get to know that I am cheating on him. So that is one point that makes me this like cohabitation. Okay, okay. There's no sanity. You, mm -hmm. you, you, you don't have any peace of mind mm -hmm. when it comes to cheating. Uh, Having all your, your 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 the attention of your partner and trying to come in terms with certain ups and downs in the relationship, it's not going to be easy when it comes to cohabitating. And I'm beginning also. Oh, but why? I'll show you. I know what I'm back. I'll show you. I know what I'm back. The least, yes. In so no more worry. There's no respect. Mm. Okay, and um, Miss Kitty, mm -hmm. now that's what she's saying. Um, young count the fact that people end up cohabiting with their partners and they cheat on them, although on worry. And this time around, we hear news today and I will up on the girlfriend because watch and do cheat. On only no, watch and do cheat and all that. Maybe a watch a second, no, they open and all that just because on your net to boom and they are probably playing in this marriage, um, practicing marriage when it's not really it. What do you think about this whole thing when it comes when we relate it to cohabiting? I still stand on my point. Which is <laughs> that relationship eh, is meant for mature people. Okay. She said something about sanity. Mm -hmm. We have people who are dating or in a relationship who respect themselves more than married couples. Yes. And I can bet my life on that. Yes, yes. For yeah, sure. I may bet my life, but we yeah, are that <laughs> And in situation as as she said, say um Ebiana, oh yeah be being a guy in the cocaine, like I said, won't worry me. If you're a lady and you don't respect yourself, you don't respect your man, it's when you will stand in front of a man yes. to challenge him with your with the things you are doing with which are bad. Mm -hmm. You yeah, get it. And that doesn't yeah. uh, uh, um dispute the fact that you are married and you cannot stand in front of your husband and tell him the same thing you're telling your, your guy in a relationship it's it's i wouldn't say it's 50 50. in fact both are not uh, guaranteed but for me, but me personally i think there's much more respect in marriage than being in a relationship and i'm telling you people respect their relationship more than marriage it's 50 50. It's so where you think it's good for you you go there Hey, who? Who? Mm. Oh, hundred percent. Hey, hey. I support. So I'm sad. telling you, okay. from experience, so I support. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay. From you get it. Yes, I see. Okay. <laughs> from experience, I support. Obi, to me, acting our way more so many years, so I wouldn't been here. We we did sixty four years, and after we did our way. Oh, oh. You know, waste of time. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Now when an apple, now we we back on the Just me, do behave like they don't know you because of what you're doing. Any person now, now that's you are this that. And then this advantage So this this guy and the lady, they had they were cohabiting, and then the lady died. Only no one back from but the lady died. Lady, no, they no or call second. Child in okay. her head, and that God, like whatever had to happen, happened, and then she died. Or more worried when she knew, and that's it. Or more worried when she yeah. And if you know, I don't know, that is a hunter culture. Oh, yeah, baby, and son, the worry is there, no one society. And I live closer to where they had the funeral, where the lady stayed. In see, see, all habits and all your cow. Okay. Whatever surrounds it. It's it's better you just convince your partner. See, we are already living together. I will or you Bible and ringer talk a key. Nay, I'm coming with share for one. You can even your wedding can see they were able to court your sign. Even now, even from then, our traditional marriage in Ghana's war is considered as marriage, of course. Yeah, yes, 
it is it's not necessarily put there being a marriage certificate. So far as the Mr. Fats know, now I should not know what yes, it was marriage. No need for cohabitation, no need for a big wedding ceremony. But maybe said the master me. Most of the time, the relationship seems so good and perfect. Until they finally walk back and forth and not together. Now I feel like in a way we 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 not together. No one who who more it helps better for the marriage. marriage. Don't you think so? Because most of the time people finally marry and they start living together and they feel like ah this is a different person that I'm married oh, to. Oh yes, because but maybe if they probably practice cohabiting at a point in their relationship now. Come be my P. Not here, that we decide to meet from me too. That's the point. Let me show. But, um, let <laughs> Why, why, why do, our, why do our Christian people say, uh, uh, court? But, mm -hmm. what is court? Good. So, there's a difference between court and, mm -hmm. and cohabitation. Mm -hmm. But, hey, I can move all my stuff and then go and live at my boyfriend's place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the show you boom. And it, it would continue for years that is cohabitated mm -hmm. but i can go to my boyfriend's house spend two nights there and then come oh, back to my place so cohabitated. that is cohabitated no, that's 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 cool. mm -hmm. getting to that's know each other that's fornication baby mm -hmm. and see, 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 fornication and don't know yet then and it's against our our religion what is against yeni abrofu you maybe i want to have a channel what is against See, I know this pastor, eh, pastor, or worry, lady, almost say, Pentecost, almost say, eh, abstain from sex, do this, do that. Or move here, no more worry, no more for honeymoon. No, my man, they do an adrenal banner feeling honey. No, my man, you know, I can buy, can buy, so boy, can buy, can buy, say, banana, you a dumb, say, can buy, can buy, or buy you could try, send a beman at the brigo. So, in this case, about. Obano soon per se. Be man per se obano be jano. None of want to say onye juma. So in this case, we buy a lot of yere. So I'm afraid from finding quite a number of women. Will you keep that silence or you will break it? I think we have advantages and disadvantages. She she doesn't support me. I will try you. If I don't go to heaven, if I don't make to heaven, I have to try. Yes, and I agree with her because if you are in the mid situation. That is what I'm saying. In court and cry, you can still have sex. Me, I will try that. The person that living with the person. Don't live with but the person. But I, I personally think, like listening to um Nana, me feel they say Nana in a way is not really condemning it. But then, no, looking at the disadvantages that comes to you, mm -hmm. whether the lady and I say man, man, because yeah. he had his own courses. Yeah, you mm. go to a whole oh, 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 yeah. oh, that. That mm -hmm. is inevitable. And that's it's meant for everybody. Imagine saying oh, you end up living with somebody for like. Ten years, eight years, five years. Now finally, I say you are not my spec. I'm talking about your day. Eka for Benin one. For Benin na jumu do. Benin na jumu do. Enu, anya na nantu am at star. Wa bra bo nanka san. Wa bra beke de ah beke de menya obo fubi efishol. At efe yen kofu abe fubi bi ya. Me friends usu. Me friends usu. Na abe fubi bi ya. Be an Asian be say be na keto dem na be na dream model. But as time goes on, you see that is why I keep saying. On what is on until na ko ha. Ebe ebe ko. On e dem umpo de an e dem be court no no. Tide court ni ala ke. Ewa. E dia awo no. But e e fa me ame na sam me boy. Na se ne na dream model. Umpo dem be he ni o o ni me nyansa. Oh, you're responsible. Not being in work in a relationship, and then in the long run, you know, could be we question you, could be watching the way he behaves. And he feels it's good for him, ma. You think he's not going to put up that behavior? And then what if I am against it? Because it's a relationship in one way. So why would I cohabitate? Whilst I know that I will look for good in a relationship. I know that it's it's there. It's 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 part of life. I can be there on the boa or data be there, found a worry penna. Nyama, I started to do a same boa or data. Benin boa on ma, a only in Suban and Chawin in Chow. The same boa song in Chawin in Chow. The woman told Bawaran, or worry any who be any true callous. In time, to me, in our churches nowadays, and let the man deen one ma, youngsters now abban, or we are one way in Yama. How? Youngsters are bad, Miss Yafo, me you fool. A woman, I need a boyfriend from Baum. And so, any parents are, and they are, or too many, a backers on 
Fabinini Briefier. No one in Abyss, any one day. Demi Benini, any fear, meaning that them Benini and Mokosha Shalom. But for being perfect is different from cohabiting with being on day. Dem ain't a young fan church, a young banana, when you be a young farm mom. My dad, my boyfriend, at, at your at your depending on your age. Okay, yeah, I make an answer. Okay, as you said, in your Christian home, depending on your age. When you made a time, made room brow there, move for being Yes, about to me, I catch your man. I mean, you see, hey, if I bring you beer and catch a man, I don't my life. When you go back, when you prepare the man, I bet your man. If I tell you my age, no, I'm not breaking heart. If I tell you my age, I reckon, hey, Archer. But it's not a matter of actual. Yeah, only there's nothing like. Much to my my culture on authority there. One part was we break my heart and I walk on. What's that about? What application? Bye bye. Because when she was a show, when she was a show, I could walk off a bit, but in there, I don't so. I mean, that comes to relationship now. The, the reason, ah, uh, and I did, I don't remember that you cheated on me. It's how you try to play on my intelligence, making me feel that it's not always even like having sexual intercourse with mm -hmm. their other partner or someone else. But even you starting to have this test messages, chats, you no know, those hidden agendas and all that. I, I, I call all, all of them cheating. Don't you don't necessarily need to go to that level. I feel co cohabitating. Uh -huh. there's, there's there's no level of res of respect. Yeah. From um, what I have seen. Yeah. There's no level of respect. Okay. Yes. And to so wrap up with it, what what are you saying? What's your general view when it comes to cohabitation and probably the advice you can give out there? Simple. It's it's two things. Mm -hmm. Personally, one. I feel cohabitating, like I said, mm -hmm. it doesn't conjure any respect. If you want to live with your your partner for life, I would advise get married. Yeah. Get married. I'm not saying go oh, and do weddings. Mm -hmm. I am yeah. saying <laughs> yes. Yeah, that's the point. Okay, the go and do weddings change yes. saying just get married. So also for part on what. So let me get to Miss Gifty. Miss Gifty, what's your general view on cohabiting and then um I'm making me laugh. <laughs> hey, I won't talk much. Mm -hmm. But um, we are responsible for our own actions. Okay. One, anything we, that we do in this life, we don't do it just for fun. Okay. Nobody makes move just for its sake. Okay. Yes. So what I would say is that in this life, eh, don't listen to what anybody will say. You do what makes you happy. Okay. Because no matter what you do, people will talk. Okay. So do what makes you happy. And as my sister said, respect is end and not gain. So your actions will make you end that respect in life. Okay. Thank you very much. It's been wonderful talking to Miss Gitti, Menu Hena. Anna Hena. Yes, please. Hena. Hena and then Nanaya Edu. Okay, my mother said, Mitchell. Say, Ete me, Kenny, you know. You've put in something here. And I want to have a drink. <laughs> wait to call. Yeah, I didn't have to wait to call now. Why am I trying to try to go? Ah, what a dream. What a good dream. I want to go to a dream. I want to go to a dream. And now, so many things are coming to me. Come on, Sister, decision. Why are you making a call? Not so only me. Because what I'm saying, they make a wrong decision. It's in the number. But then, whenever at a point in your cohabitant life you feel it's not going well, Never forget to return re back. Turn back to yes. where you belong. Mm -hmm. Don't say, I made the wrong choice. I've been here. I spent five years there, so I can't go back. Please go back. There's always time for every time. Yes. Well, today's glam look is by 
makeup by Lodi's makeup and the makeup it was on my iPhone. And Marcus said, today I am feeling myself. <laughs> I am feeling myself like something. And it's by Lodi's makeup. And you should Lodi's makeup at Okojo Chrome. You can call her on 0556-313343. 0556-313343. If a day you make up for weddings, for parties, any events, just contact her. That's the number on the screen. Also, my dress is by Amy's Shop Afrique. Your mama, madame, my friend, madame Amy. You know, on our local madam, mom. Eh, simple and classy. I see. I'm looking nice, right? Oh, you know, simple and classy. More than nice. My master team, you don't need part. You know, you do. Amy's Shop Afrique did my dress for you. You can locate her at Banchasi. And her number is 0244-692816. 0244-692816. Any atelier, if a wedding gown, engagement dress, I'm from my to walk on in the full atelier, if you have a for that wedding party, guess anyone. This is the FAO for wedding spa. And she can contact her and she will give you the best style that you need. Also, my hair. In the mirror, you know, I'm a black American from the other thing. Oh. Uh -huh. My hair is by X and Y History. She's located at Lagos Town. You can contact her on 0578-128100. Or Lagos Town Hospital Road Hono. I will say her phone number. Just call the number on the screen and she'll pick you up. She does locks, ribbons, braids. Don't worry. today so contact her and she will get you sorted for your weddings, parties, any event. She got you. You be. I got you. <laughs> okay, so it's been the vibe show today. The topic was cohabitation. And we've learned a lot. Um, what for the classmates in Classmate. classmates and joint. Joints. My mom, my short time, baby, I must the show now. Mom. Oh, mini, mini, mini problem, mini problem. Hey, okay, so let's go. Do you want to say something? Oh, to classmates, you? um, pap or joint. Okay, it's it's a pap, though. Okay, over here, pap. Our oh, um, double road in the Cape Coast station, double road in oh, town, okay. tack riding. Okay. Where in town. Then? Uh, it's a pap. Oh, it's a pap. Yeah, the orders. So yeah, yeah, the band for weddings, parties, okay. naming ceremony, name it. Even if it's for four people. And I have been in a any any a year and any girlfriend and all you know, never see you can cry with that show fridge. I will fall down. I was thinking something. Yeah, but you know, that she fridge me down on what I can say that. So back up for you. So, all the other things, so that's class major. Let me get to another year quickly. So, um, mine is Jurassic Enterprise. We are basically into events planning and organizing, we are into catering services into local bar services, cocktail services. Mm. I am your queen mixologist. Okay. And then um, I also have an ocean and waiting agency okay. in Takradi here. We also travel outside to okay. Kenya Takradi. Okay. And see, if you need ushers and waiters for any of your events, funeral, parties, weddings, okay. seminars, yeah. Contact okay. Juros is enterprise. Okay. Now, now you have some sponsors you should. Over your cocktails, they are very good. What do you think of the crap? What's your different? What is that? What is that? Now, now you have some of them. Now, hey. Thank you very much. It's been great having Miss Gifty Menno Hena on the show and also Nanaya Edu. Thank you so much. Thank you for staying till now. You know I love you, right? Yeah, I love you. This is the vibe show. We'll meet again next week. It's bye for now. My name is Baki.